Slaughterhouse Five by Kurt Vonnegut. Very famous book. This is a Folio Society edition with a plain red slipcover. Let's have a look at the spine. I've read this book a couple of times, but I've never read this edition. This is my uh, edition that I bought when I thought to myself, I really should have Slaughterhouse Five on the shelf somewhere. And I realized that I didn't. This is the font, it gets a very, very long subtitle. And the illustrations are by John Holder. I don't love the illustrations. Uh, I don't know if it's just this style that I don't love. I think I would like it for a different kind of book. Slaughterhouse Five is very funny, but it's also very sad and very brutal. And I feel like maybe these illustrations don't cover the brutality. They don't feel as brutal as the book it does. Anyway, the pages are very nice and thick, and the text is big and easy to read. There we have it, Slaughterhouse Five. Oh well, should I tell you something about what it's about? I won't tell you much about what it's about, because it's a crazy, crazy book, and if you hear what it's about, you might not want to read it. There's a lot of World War II, but <laughs> there's more than just World War II. There's something of aliens and, and a different way of thinking about time. And um, yeah, but there's a lot of World War II. If you've ever read any Vonnegut then, and you liked him, then you'll probably like this one as well. If you've read Vonnegut and didn't like him, it's, it's a toss up. I loved this book myself, and that's why I needed to have it on my shelf. Kurt Vonnegut's Slaughterhouse Five.